1993, a.k.a. Justin Ledger, coming at you with this video. Right here, right now, Sugarbush Showcase, Kyle Larson, instead of jumping him in the TQ Sprints, we are putting him in the 410 All-Star Race. We're going to get this started right here, right now. We did not practice. We qualified bad. We started. We are going to qualify second. Hopefully, we can make the qualify dash. If not, we can always come back. Hopefully, to pray that we can make the A main. But like I said, as a rookie, let's see if I can get him close to having a decent season in his first year. Not going to be so competitive, maybe, but. I guess we'll find out how Kyle does. So here we go. We're in heat two. <clears throat> top three events to the A main. Top two events to the qualified dash. Just remember that. And we're at Sugar Bush. This is one of my favorite tracks in another game. But here we go. Green flag. We're underway. We're in P5. 12 laps is the distance for the heat. We have time, so we don't have to rush to get up there. Top three, like I said, advance to the A main. Inside the grass, going to battle with Davis for third. And Davis is going to give me a hard time here, trying to get around Davis. Ten laps to go. Ooh, into the wall we go early. Back and forth. Davis now has that final transfer spot. Side by side with Davis ramping up with him. Eight to go here. And once again, Davis has the transfer spot. Ooh, boy, oh boy, that was a bad slide job right there. Six laps to go in Heat 2 for this Kyle Larson series. We clear Davis again. Can we hang on to that final transfer spot? And yes, I know this is not his number. This is not the color of his car. And of course, Dunn's going to hold people up. And now it's back and forth between me and Davis again. And Larson goes up wide. No choice there to take fourth in that predicament. Final lamp, and I don't think Kyle Larson is going to get the spot. And unfortunately, he's going to have to battle into the main event to get that spot one more final time, but he's not going to get it done. And unfortunately, he's going to he's finishing in fourth. He's going to have to battle his way up into the B main. But there it is for your Heat 2 results. Congratulations, Paul McMahon, on the win in the Heat. Jeremy Davis, boy, I tell you. And here's the goal. He has to be in the top five in order to make the big show. He is on the front 
row Kyle Larson, ladies and gentlemen, to remind you, Kyle Larson has to be in the top five to make the big show tonight. 30 laps is the B-Main. And we are underway. We're going to get around Miller. But Miller's not going to give it up so easily. side around Bennett. Bennett's not going to take it. Bennett's going to get it down the back stretch. And Kyle's going to hit that wall just enough and it's going to fall him back to fourth. Now he's in trouble for the Jeopardy spots. He's in the last spot for the trial, the final transfer spot, guys. And I am trying my best to get him into the tonight's show. But everybody is battling to keep him away from that spot as a rookie. Carpenter now is going to battle for third with me. In the grass we go. Bennett's going to go low. I'm going to go low, and I'm going to try to stick my tires right underneath Bennett for a second. Battling for Bennett with Bennett for a second. We're in the grass again. And we are in lamp traffic with almost 20 lamps left to go, gentlemen. Ladies and gentlemen and boys and girls of all ages. And Dixon's going to hold me up. But I'm going to clear Dixon. I'm going to get around Lawson. Clark's going to go bottom when he should go high. And Clark's going to hold me up, of course. And we're going to take a look at the intervals, everybody. And I still have a chance to get Kyle Larson the B-Main win, but it's not going to happen because Kyle Larson's going to hit the wall. We are right there, ladies and gentlemen. Abby Barnes is only a second ahead of Kyle Larson. Ooh, and I don't know what just happened there. I think that guy just spun out. My bad. My apologies. 13 laps left to go.
Lamp traffic is holding her up big time. And Abby Barnes is going to get holded up here. Coming to 10 to go. Can we get the B main win? Barnes is going to take the lead again. And not this time. Kyle Larson closes the door, but Abby Barnes is right here. Nine to go. Back and forth for the lead. we hit the wall and we hit the wall and it's not going to be a good time because Abby Barnes is only a second away Four to go. Oh, and we almost lost it there. From two seconds down to almost one half of a second. Two to go. Let's see if we can get him to win. And the white flag is out this time. Bye. Down the back stretch for the final time in the B main. Round three and four. Can we clear it okay, Lee? And we're not going to clear it, but Kyle Larson will win the B main. Starting 16th in the A main, we got our work cut out. There is your B main results, ladies and gentlemen. Here we go. His his goal is to stay in the top 15. And we are underway at Sugar Bush for the main event. 60 lamps to go, 60 to do it. Going to work my way through the field. In the 14th position right now. Going to go low. Going to get under number 6 here. Oh, and that's not going to be good. And now we are in 12th. But we still have time to get it done. Diaz is going to go round.
And I don't think I've ever seen a battle as much as this is out. Uh, this guy is for this A main. But again, the goal is just to get him into the top 15. And he is so far, he is doing his job. Larson and Zerfoss is battling back and forth for 10th right now. Oh, and that was huge. Kyle Larson hangs on to it, though, and he's back in 10th. Boy, this is going to be an interesting series, ladies and gentlemen. I'm telling you right now, you guys got to keep an eye on this series because this is going to be a good one. Here comes Mr. Tony Stewart, and Tony Stewart's going to give it, and we're going to let him take it. Oh, and we almost collected Stewart, and that would have been my fault right then and there. We also got to remember, ladies and gentlemen, that this is, he is not in a fast car yet. So, with that being said, he's, we just got to take our time. Kyle's just got to take his time. He might not win a race, but at least he'll get there eventually. Top 10 is better than nothing for his first time in a car even knowing that this is a real NASCAR driver but this is awful fun you know like I said it's gonna be enjoyment and uh, hopefully we all have a good time and hopefully you guys view these this you know I'm gonna try my best to commentate as much as I can and we are lap down ladies and gentlemen so we're gonna let the lap leaders go around we don't want to hold them up any more than we have to. We are coming to 40 to go this time around. And at this point, we have not had one single caution flag. But I must say a top 10 is not bad. But let me tell you something. 
You think Kyle Larson has his work out for him? Casey Johnson replacing myself behind the wheel at Ledgewood Motorsports is going to be a tough, tough go around for him to replace a champion like myself is going to be huge for him. And this is going to be a long, long night. Going to be under two laps here pretty soon. And well, we will be under that two laps. you guys got to do, I guess. I mean, you can't really complain. I mean, top 10 is better than nothing. I mean, we are going to be two lamps down, possibly more before the end of this race is over. Coming to 30 to go. Coming to the halfway mark here, and 25 laps left to go. I, I honestly don't know what to say here, everybody. I mean, being two laps down kind of sucks. But, like I said, the series is just starting. And, you know, goal is just to have a good time. It's We're going to be having fun here. and I'm not quite sure who's in the lead right now. I believe it's Tony Stewart.
I honestly, guys, I don't think I've ever seen me be three laps down in an event like this. Even on Tony, uh, the other Tony Stewart game, uh, usually it's only maybe a lap or two, but wow, this takes me back to my NASCAR days on PlayStation 2 being three lamps down. Going to get off the topic here. Who's going to be launching the Bush Clash tonight? I'm kind of curious of how that how that race is going to go. Not that big of a venue, but I guess we'll find out. Super Bowl is next set next Sunday. Still rooting for the Cincinnati Bengals to get it done. There could be another series coming here pretty soon here, guys. Uh, a TJ Pierce series is most likely going to be coming. Uh, and that one's going to be on SRX the game. And most likely I'm going to have him race most likely the late models and most likely the trucks. And we're probably going to stay away from the asphalt as much as we can. Uh, if I can do a custom series on there, I will introduce that as we get going here. We are yet another lap down. Coming to five to go this time by. And that's it. Would be in four lamp sound. That's it for that race. But we did finish in the top ten. We did meet our goal. And Paul McMahon is the winner. And for some reason, there's only three guys left on the lead lap. And I just don't understand this. But anyways, congrats to Paul McMahon on the win. Tony Stewart nearly almost beat him. But we did get a top ten even though we finished four laps down, but of course you can't really do nothing about it when you're in a hot seat car. But, like I said, Kyle Larson did get a top 10, met the goal, satisfied sponsors hopefully, and now what I'm going to do is I'm going to do another video so you guys can know the number, the scheme that you're going to see, and then we'll go from there. So, I will see you in a bit.